Question 48.6. Questioner, thank you. I would like to take as an example an entity, starting before birth, who is roughly high on the seniority list for positive polarization and possible harvestability at the end of this cycle and follow a full cycle of his experience starting before his incarnation, which body is activated, the process of becoming incarnate, the activation of the third density physical body, the process as the body moves through this density and is acted upon by catalysts the process of death, and the activation of the various bodies so that we make a full circuit from a point prior to incarnation back around through incarnation and death, you might say one cycle of incarnation in this density. Could you do that for me? Answer, I am Ra. Your query is most distorted for it assumes that creations are alike. Each mind, body, spirit complex has its own patterns of activation and its own rhythms of awakening. The important thing for harvest is the harmonious balance between the various energy centers of the mind, body, spirit complex. This is to be noted as of relative import. We grasp the thrust of your query and will make a most general answer stressing the unimportance of such arbitrary generalizations. The entity, before incarnation, dwells in the appropriate, shall we say, place in time-space. The true color type of this location will be dependent upon the entity's needs. Those entities for instance which, being wanderers, have the green, blue or indigo true color core of mind, body, spirit complex will have rested therein. Entrance into incarnation requires the investment or activation of the indigo ray or etheric body for this is the, for maker. The young or small physical mind, body, spirit complex has the seven energy centers potentiated before the bidding process. They are also analogs in time space of these energy centers corresponding to the seven energy centers in each of the seven true color densities. Thus in the microcosm exists all the experience that has prepared. It is as though the infant contains the universe. The patterns of activation of an entity of high seniority will undoubtedly move with some rapidity to the green ray level which is the springboard to primary blue. There is always some difficulty in penetrating blue primary energy for it requires that which your people have in great paucity, that is, honesty. Blue ray is the ray of free communication with self and with other self. Having accepted that an harvestable or nearly harvestable entity will be working from this green ray springboard one may then posit that the experiences in the remainder of the incarnation will be focused upon activation of the primary blue ray of freely given communication, of indigo ray, that of freely shared intelligent energy, and if possible, moving through this gateway the penetration of violet ray intelligent infinity. This may be seen to be manifested by a sense of the consecrate or hallowed nature of everyday creations and activities. Upon the bodily complex death as you call this transition, the entity will immediately, upon realization of its state, return to the indigo form maker body and rest therein until the proper future placement is made. Here we have the anomaly of harvest. In harvest the entity will then transfer its indigo body into violatory manifestation as seen in true color yellow. This is for the purpose of gauging the harvestability of the entity. After this anomalous activity has been carefully completed, the entity will move into indigo body again and be placed in the correct true color locus in space-time and time-space at which time thy healings and learned teachings necessary shall be completed and further incarnation needs determined. Question 48.7 Questioner who supervises the determination of further incarnation needs and sets up the seniority list for incarnation. Answer, I am Ra. This is a query with two answers. Firstly, there are those directly under the guardians who are responsible for the incarnation patterns of those incarnating automatically, that is, without conscious self-awareness of the process of spiritual evolution. You may call these beings angelic if you prefer. They are, shall we say, local or of your planetary sphere. The seniority of vibration is to be likened unto placing various grades of liquids in the same glass. Some will rise to the top, 
others will sink to the bottom. Layers and layers of entities will ensue. As harvest draws near, those filled with the most light and love will naturally, and without supervision, be in line, shall we say, for the experience of incarnation. When the entity becomes aware in its mind, body, spirit complex totality of the mechanism for spiritual evolution it, itself, will arrange and place those lessons and entities necessary for maximum growth and expression of polarity in the incarnative experience before the forgetting process occurs. The only disadvantage of this total free will of those senior entities choosing the manner of incarnation experiences is that some entities attempt to learn so much during one incarnative experience that the intensity of catalyst disarranges the polarized entity and the experience thus is not maximally useful as intended. Question 48.8 Questioner an analogy to that would be a student in college signing up for more courses than he could possibly assimilate in the time they were given. Is this correct? Answer, I am Ra. This is correct. Question 48.9 Questioner, could you tell me how the various bodies, red through violet, are linked to the energy centers, red through violet? Are they linked in some way? Answer, I am Ra. This shall be the last full query of this working. As we have noted, each of the true color densities has the seven energy centers and each entity contains all this in potentiation. The activation, while in yellow ray, of violet ray intelligent infinity is a passport to the next octave of experience. There are adepts who have penetrated many, many of the energy centers and several of the true colors. This must be done with utmost care while in the physical body for as we noted when speaking of the dangers of linking red-orange-yellow circuitry with true color blue circuitry the potential for disarrangement of the mind, body, spirit complex is great. However, the entity who penetrates intelligent infinity is basically capable of walking the universe with unfettered tread. Is there any brief query before we leave this instrument? Question 48.10. Questioner, just if there is anything that we can do to make the instrument more comfortable or to improve the contact? Answer, I am Ra. All is well. As we have said, this instrument is weak physically and continued work times will lengthen this weakness. The continued contact also aids in the continued climb in vital energy of the instrument as well as the integration and in vital energy of the group as a unit. The choice is yours. We are pleased. All is well. You are conscientious. Continue so. I am Ra. I leave you in the love and in the light of the one infinite creator. Go forth, then, my friends, rejoicing in the power and in the peace of the one infinite creator. Adonai.